starts and what I'm looking for from Hero is just finding his distance, controlling the exchanges, keeping Zulu, who's a really good striker, uncomfortable. We're putting that in Zulu's mind. We know we can get you on the feet, but we have to worry about the takedown as well. I think Zulu really got his distance like, like we planned to. He did, he did a really good job, good front kicks, but I think Hero absolutely knew that he had to take him down at the end of that first round. He's gonna come and shoot! Once Hero got this thing to the ground, he absolutely dominated him. You can tell that Zulu just did not want anything to do with Hero's jiu-jitsu. Hero landed some big shots, and then he was able to sink in the choke. Let's go, Zulu! And I thought that was it. I thought it was over. But hey, Zulu hung in there. He rode it out and made it to the end of the round. I love this about guys. Zulu knew he lost the first round, so in round two, he came out very aggressive. He was going for the knockout. He was trying to land kicks, strikes. But Hero was able to take him to the ground again. Hero took his back and was looking for that choke. And once he sunk that choke in, you knew there was no way Zulu was getting out of that one. It was a solid performance. He followed his game plan and got the first win for Key Benavides. Winner due to a rear naked choke, Hiromasa.